Spectrobes was one of the best-selling third-party Nintendo DS games of 2007, and now work on Spectrobes Beyond the Portals is underway here in Kyoto, Japan, and you're invited. Spectrobes Beyond the Portals reunites planetary patrol officers Rollin and Gina. This time, however, players will be in control of more than 1,000 different Spectrobe combinations, including the devious Dark Spectrobes. But before we get ahead of ourselves, let's visit with Japanese developer Jupiter, the creative team behind Spectrobes and the new game, Spectrobes Beyond the Portals. Hi, konnichiwa. Hi everyone, I'm Kentaro Hisai, producer on Spectrobes. Today I'd like to show you around Jupiter. But before I do that, I'm going to take off my shoes. Here in Japan, it's common to take off your shoes in buildings. This is the design team. They are the ones responsible for all the design work on Spectrobes, including the Spectrobe designs you can see on the wall over there. This is the main designer, Sakaya-san, and that's the enemy designer, Tanigawa-san. If you take a look right behind Sakaya-san, you can see art for the Spectrobes lined up on the wall, including the Dark Spectrobes. I think the Dark Spectrobes are going to be the coolest monsters in the game. Over in this area is the planning team, and this is Tanaka-san, who's been working on Spectrobe since the very beginning. You can say he's a number one game creator. <laughs> and the person who is in charge of all the different elements programming in Spectrobes is this man, art director Kiriyama-san. This is the BG team, the people behind the awesome 3D backgrounds in Spectrobes. And their leader is this guy here, art director Furomura-san. This is the programming team. They've been working hard on creating two new unique battle systems. There are field battles where Round can fight the crawl alone, and also encounter battles where the Spectrobes fight the crawl. This game will have both battle systems, so everyone you see here belongs to the programming team. And over here are the sound effect designers who make all the sound effects in the game. Look at the wall over there. You can see all the cool worlds Rollin is going to go to. The left side is the Nanairo system, and the right side is a whole new part of space that Rollin and Gina will go to by using portals. The relationship between Disney and Jupiter is unique. Disney has been creating original content for a long time now, especially with animated features. And now we've come to a generation where we have portable gaming devices that can be used to offer kids really fun and cool content. This is where Jupiter comes in. Jupiter is a company, as you'll see with Spectrobes, that loves to go overboard and puts a tremendous amount of content and effort into their games. I think it's a magical combination. 